it is anymore. I'm totally confused. It's just getting closer. We're supposed to go to East Ridge today, and this will be an opportunity for us to um, go to a different part of the district. The district is mostly um, Hamilton County, but it also includes parts of East Ridge and even parts of Bradley County, which, um, needless to say, is a very different area. It's an area um, that's mostly white, mostly older. And um, we know that we have to connect and we have to show that we want to represent all areas of the district. And uh, race and, and age should not make a difference at all because, you know, all of us have parents, all of us have people who we interact with on a day to day basis that don't look like us or may not come from the same places or same background that we come from. But that doesn't mean we can't connect with them. And that doesn't mean that we don't have similar experiences, you know, having a family, having children, you know, working the whole nine. All those things are common experiences. And so, when, you know, the money gets short, everybody knows that, whether you're white, black, red, yellow, male or female. So, you know, the things that we believe we can um, bring to the table and connect and, you know, hopefully that will enable us to, again, help spread our message so that more people will recognize that, you know, we're really trying to, uh, you, you know, we, we want to put out and we want to be part of something that, it, that that doesn't exclude people but includes people and so that's why we're going tonight to East Ridge and you know really don't know what sort of reception I receive you know another big difference is between the Republican Democrat you know I am running as a Democrat but it's a largely Republican area and again we hope that you know those sorts of things won't be the things that turn people off but instead will hopefully you know if we can cross that cross that bridge people will give us a chance and they'll listen to what we have to say and we'll go from there In Chattanooga, we have a thing where citizens can address the council and they have three minutes. And after that three minutes, it's a very strict cutoff. And I used to feel, you know, hey, that's, that's kind of strict, you know, to give people just a limited amount of time and be done. But, you know, after going to an event like tonight, I can certainly appreciate why it's why you have to keep that time structured because otherwise it can get out of control really easy.